Welcome back guys, Slow Bacon here and welcome back to episode number two of our Grimm and the Grey Vampire Count campaign playthrough. So let's carry on, we've just taken Eshin. Uh, our main man has leveled up, so we've got that one there, which is so good, it's such a good spell, I can't believe it. Right, so what else do we want to take? I probably want to look at one of those top ones, so I'm just having a look at these here at the moment. So research rate 10%, raise dead cost minus 15%, that would be very handy. Replenishes hit points. Oh, that's also very good. Um, kind of want to go with that, eh? It'll give us a buff, uh, army-wide buff. I have to obviously replenish the hit points of our units, so that's very, very good. So do you want to upgrade this? Probably want to hold off on it from that there, right? Yep, so. Castle Temp Is it Castle Temperhof that has the thing? Forest, yes it is. So that's where we want to build our forest units. Because they get the plus t uh, plus three to all forest units and then the minus 20% recruitment cost. So we definitely want to build that there. Now obviously our main target here is Waldenhof. And then we want to come down and take Fort and sh 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 that place there. That's, <laughs> that's the ones we want to take. Right. Do we have movement or in turn? We're at in turn. Okay, but we also want to do this quest here. Um, I'm wondering if I should upgrade this army a wee bit before we try and do that. I can't do that. It's level eight. Can build grave guard. Um, probably want to knock off some of these skellies, eh? Let's combine these. My cruelty knows no Why can't I build that? Oh, I can't yet because I don't have the ancient up. Oh, well, why did you show me that I could? All right, that's fine. Let's get some more skellies there then. Uh, we'll get rid of this one. It's two units of skellies. That's cool. Let's just build them. We're going to go spears. Mm. Nah, nah, let's just go normal skellies. And then next turn we'll jump up here and we'll do this quest. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll do the quest. Should be alright, right? I don't think there should be too many issues there for us. Uh, I'm not too worried about them. Our garrisons should be... Uh, not that one. Our garrisons should be okay. Oh, it's not actually a very big garrison, is it? Uh, can we upgrade anything there to increase the garrison? Not at this stage. Dang. Okay, right. Let's jump up here and do this quest, eh? Oh, it's 50-50. Obviously, we have the numbers of advantages we normally would as vampire counts. They have the quality advantage. Um, let's do it. We should be okay. We'll just do our double lines. Maybe you want to hold off the um, Graveguard and the Upgraded or the Renown Skeleton Warriors. Maybe make them their own group. Give us a bit of uh, power if we could like scoot around the back. Or do we want to hit with them at the front? Mm. Yeah, I think I want to put my power units in the middle. Can we skip that? Yes, we can. Uh, I don't even get the chance to set up. No, okay, that's annoying. Why am I even over here? Thanks. Oh. Right, what have we got laid out? Very poorly. <laughs> What's in the middle here? Skeletons, okay. Let's group up these zombies. So I kind of want these two in like the middle, because that's like my real power units. Three. He needs to be like in the middle. Oh, and I can. Ah, cool. What am I doing? Right, so I want these guys at the front. Oh, I remember this quest. I remember. And I kind of want these guys in the middle, because that's like my strength units at the moment. And then on either side of them I want to put my skeletons. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Uh, somewhere about there. Yeah, happy with that. Corpse cart coming in behind my power units, that's good. Lord in behind there as well, so he's got... Uh, Where's this buff one? Not that one, not that one. That one, oh, it was that one, okay. No, it wasn't. It wasn't that one at all, was it? Mm, I don't know. Is it just a passive? Maybe it's just a passive. Yeah, it's just a passive. Okay, cool. That's cool. Right, and then we want our dogs. They've got cavalry on this right-hand flank, I remember that, yes. 
Um, do I want to eat the charge with my dogs? Not really. I really want them to swing around the back if they can. Uh, are they hidden there? They should be hidden there, right? Because they're behind the cliff. Surely. Right, now let's group all these guys together <laughs> after I just did all that. Right, that's cool. Uh, that's it for the dogs. Uh, can we ungroup these? Uh, no, not that one. Uh, uh, shift. No. Oh, God, I can't remember. I can't remember. We'll have to drag and drop. Let's go. Right, so that's the formation we want, which means our zombies are going to hit first, followed by our power units, and then we've got our flanking skeletons, right? So that's cool. Oh, uh, backed up by our buffing unit, which is, of course, the corpse cart. And then our dogs to come in from behind, because they do have some ranged, I believe. Yes, they do. And hopefully take them out. Right, let's go. Right, let's start our Miranda Ford. So if they leave one of the arrangements exposed, we'll shoot around the back and get them. I don't want to... Yeah, they are hidden at the moment. That's good. Yeah, I don't want to expose these yet. Spears. Where is the arranged? Kind of in the middle. Yeah, that's a bit annoying. Ah, uh, my dogs are no longer hidden. Ah, oh, damn it. Pull them back. Now they're hidden. Yeah, yeah, nice. Just stay there. I'm going to peel off two units to attack my dogs. That's fine. Let's put these guys on run. I, will in their blood. I think I will spawn a um, graveguard unit this time. Probably probably around the back, eh? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. If my... Um, oh, shit, they're shooting my dogs. If my zombies can eat this charge, that'll be great, because these guys are going to wreck us otherwise. Right, scout. Soaking that damage, good boys, good zombies. Wait till we get closer before we pop either of these. They will come when I call. Ah, so that's a buff to melee to everybody around us. Oh, that'll work out quite nicely. So here comes the right guard, that's good. Collapse in on them. They'll destroy this, there's not a lot I can do about that. Do I have. Where are my spears? My spears are on the other side, aren't they? Ah, uh, it's annoying. Okay. Right, let's pop this. If they left their ranged exposed, not yet. Right, now they're starting to push forward with that other unit, so we'll bring up our dogs now. Right, let's get our grave guard up and running from... Should we can spawn them on the top of them. Why the crap you're running away out there, mister? Cool, yeah, so we've got a unit of grave guard spawned right on top of two of their units. One of them being ranged, so that's nice. We should destroy that quite easily. Uh, we don't want to chase the right guard, but they will come back on us. There's fucking zombies everywhere. Right, where's my dogs? My dogs in there? Yes, they are. Cool, that unit of range has been destroyed. Actually, that's their leader. Get on top of him. Pop a heal on our grave guard. Corpse cuts doing well. I bring these zombies in to help out here, please. These guys don't seem to be doing much. Can you push forward a wee bit? Right, so that's their range dealt with, or one of their ranged. Jump in here, actually, and give us... Uh, get, uh, oh, that's me. That's why I can't click on it, because that's me. Right, get on our, that lord there. Nice. Pop that for no particular reason, just because we need to. Uh, heals to go out. Can you heal yourself? Yes, you can. 
Shit, comes a right scud into the back of our lord. Okay, we don't want that. This is the risen grave guard that we've got here. Into the back of these. That's yeah, no, that's fine. That's fine. Right, that's that. That's good. Right, bring these guys over too. Help out over here. Oh, my dogs, my dogs. Get out of there, doggies. Uh, I think we might have just lost that unit. Hopefully not. Hopefully we can break out. Uh, uh, damn. Damn, damn. We lost one of our units of renown. This guy's doing all right. 61 kills. Those range units are still tearing us apart. Um, I don't have anything fast. I don't have cripples or anything to run over there. Which is a bit unfortunate, but that's down. It's going to go down rather shortly. Keep an eye on that lord of ours. Right, these guys need to break off and get over here. These guys going? I'm not sure. They need to come in as well. We're fine. We're fine. We're not going to lose, but I don't. Oh, Jesus! If my lord goes down, we might. Jesus, son. Can you hear yourself or not? Can we pop it down there, and you'll get a passive heal from that. Yeah, he's got it. Oh God. It's a bit of a worry. That is a bit of a worry. If you lose your lords, you're in a lot of trouble. Everything else will break. Jesus, I wasn't watching. Hey, he's going to go down. Uh. Alright, we need to finish this like now. Before everything else breaks. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Still fine. The rest of them should hold because we've got such a huge advantage. <laughs> oh, keep an eye on that Lord Slide. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it was pretty bad idea to put him where he was, but it was. Oh, I guess he wasn't. Oh, well, yeah, he is a wizard. I guess it was bad. That was a bad move. Um, we will take. Replenishment, oh, thanks. Cool, so we got a Necromancer and a Gold Sigil. Nice. Ah, oh, our main lord's dead. Um, oh, jeez, look at this dude. Ghoul King. Oh, like, oh, he's a Ghoul King. Too. Oh, so these are the new um, lords and stuff. Master Necromancer, Vampire Lords, they're the originals. So Ghoul Kings is obviously a new one. Let's grab one of them, I guess. Uh, anyone in particular? Plus five income, that sounds good. We're going to replace him anyway. But let's just have a look at his skill trees. This one's a unit of crypt goals. Oh, nice. And he gets a terror geist. Oh. oh, I do like him. Oh, look at him. Nice. Alright, so we want to take Wardenhof. Can we attack it this turn? Yes. So we'll auto resolve that one for the win. Nice. And that'll give us Eastern Sylvania. Nice. So with that, we want to go uh, probably public order if we have to. Called a plus. F it's not actually that. It's only minus one at the moment. But, so we'll take this for now. Right. Well, how long do we have to wait to replace them? Uh, we available five turns. Holy crap! Okay. Huh? Oh, did I just click on somebody else? Oh, fuck. I think I did. Oh, don't worry about it. I'll make too much of a difference. See, now, did Wardenhof also have... No, it didn't. didn't have any special buildings for the foresty thing. Alright, that's fine. Uh, well, it's got a forest there anyway, so that's fine. Uh, let's get rid of it. Let's get rid of it, because we're building one over here. We've got one over here anyway. 
Um, do we want to upgrade? No, we want to wait for that to get up to level 3 first. Yep. So we'll hold off on that. Uh, recruiting wise, I think we have a group of zombies. Not too worried about that. At this stage, we'll just cancel that. Right. Uh, can I replace them back with one of those other lords? One of those cool looking ones? Yeah, it was stupid of me. It was this guy here. It's not really what I wanted. We'll take him then. That might be the um, start of our second army. I might have him in charge of our second army just because he looks so cool. Alright. Let's go cool. into. So that's Eastern Sylvania. Now we're going to try and capture Western Sylvania. What do you want, Tempelhof? Trying to defend yourself, Peace Treaty? I don't think so. So they've only got the fort left, I believe. Oh, that's a lot of money. News of your conquests spreads far and wide. I need to be a wee bit careful your of these guys. Power is noted by even the most distant of kings and best I might hit this just to destroy it. And then shoot down there. Right, let's, let's get a group of zombies just to round us out. Right, let's go. Uh, okay, no, we're not at war with them, so let's not. Yeah, let's go. Get us over here. Actually, if we can go right on that border, that'd be ideal. I do like this crypt guy. Are we still on the border? Yes. Okay, cool. Right, uh, right so what do you want to build here? Could do a growth building. We've got bats and dogs in... Oh, we should put some bats into the army, I think. Let's go growth here. We should be able to recruit bats, right? Ah, oh, because we're in Force March, so we can't at the moment. Okay, that's a shame. I wonder as this thing upgrades or levels up, does it get extra abilities? I wonder. Okay. Didn't we get a um, hero unit as well? Like Schwarzenhoff, non-aggression pack, that's fine for now. We will attack you shortly, but for now it's fine. Three grand? No, sorry. Defeat him a battle. Okay, well, it's cool. We're going that way anyway. Yeah, we did here. Okay, so it was a necromancer. So I would like to have him into this army if I could. Let's knock off one of these uh, zombies and then we can get him into the army. Or not. Better bloody not. Yeah, embed him in the army. Well, that means we do have two spellcasters, which isn't ideal, but that's fine. Right, and then let's... Can I not... There we go. Can I still not change stance? Oh, that's because of the, this guy. Alright, well, you can jump back out for one turn. Because I want to get some um, bats into here. Oh, we lost our dogs, too. I can't get them until level 5. Okay. I would like two units of bats if I could. Yeah. Uh, well, that's going to make us 20. That's too much, isn't it? Yeah, it's alright. 19, because then we're going to put him back in. Can I put him back in now? No, next turn it'll happen. Let's go. Alright. Our gun building wise, waiting for this one. How close are we? Surplus population is at 1. Four turns, so four turns until we can go up to level two for that. Let's go. We will do that. I just want the bats to give me a wee bit of mobility. Because at the moment I have absolutely none. Do you need fresh troops? No, I need you into my army, please. How are we looking? I get my lord back. Two turns, okay. Oh, he's so cool. Right, let's just do this attack. There's no point waiting. Because he's just going to recruit. Oh, yeah, it's a walkover. That's an absolute walkover. Okay. Oh, he took a bit of damage. Jesus. How did we get? 700 bucks. No, we want to occupy. Okay. It's been obliterated. Nice. Oh, 
Okay. Well, let's just look at this. So, I do like that. But that means everybody's going down the same path. <clears throat> Alright, so that's his melee path up the top. It's his caster. That's his buffs. That's his campaign movement. Okay. You think decent arrays dead? No. Right, so this is our next target. And that'll give us all of Sylvania. Which is a good position to be in. Alright, let just come back. We can't, okay. We're still a few turns away before we can upgrade anything there. What about this guy? Nothing, okay. Minus a nine, that's a bit of an issue. Oh, we'll call it plus ten. Okay, so we can take this off now. Um, do we want to go plus one for recruits, or do you want the growth? Probably the growth at this stage. Um, so we also lose the um, poison bonus by not having our legendary lord in there. What's that guy doing apart from killing himself? Oh my god. There's orcs. It's all oh, they've taken Oaken Hammer. Noise. Oh, we're unhappy over there. Just as I change my public order thing. Uh, still seem to be alright. Not likely. How are those guys? Free company militia. Nice. That's one of the new units. Awesome. Alright, so we should be able to replace this guy now. Ah, no, one, two. Oh, that was two turns, you wally. Alright, back into town. I don't think there's anything we can recruit. Yeah, no, there's any more bats. We're not too worried about that at this stage. He's one turn away from being able to upgrade you. Those are cool. We're going to have to play some um, Empire at some stage as well. Just so we can have a look at the, <coughs> excuse me, dying. Just so we can have a look at the new units. Oh, plus 10 growth, nice, income. Plus 15%, awesome. Uh, three lords are back, even though I only lost two. One of those was my own fault. Right, let's, uh, actually they're all my own fault. Let's get you back into the army, thank you very much. Right, let's push down. We may be able to take that with this army, I don't know. It's quite a decent army. Right, this thing can upgrade. North. How we going over here? Nothing. Can I assist you? Um, we're not in any place to mass recruit, no. Oh, that's really annoying how they put that card on there, even though you don't officially have access to it until we unlock this. Which is why we're upgrading this to level 3. So we'll get, obviously, these. Uh, I haven't built any of that. <laughs> we get this and this, which will give us some knights. And it will also give us um, our graveguard. I do want to go down there. Path two though. Uh, that's been built over in Temple Hoff, so not too worried about that. Did, did I start upgrading that thing? No, we need to wait for Yeah, is it plus four now? We need to wait for this before we go into this line. Hmm. <coughs> Some pretty cool new units in there, eh? I'm actually really like to be fair, I wasn't overly hyped about the Grim and the Grave DLC, but there's some pretty cool units in here. Oh, technologies. Uh, more corruption or more income and growth. Income and growth, that sounds good. Actually, I don't want to mind getting both of them. That's okay. I don't know if I can take that army there. One of your spies who flits between the courts of mortal men seems to be... Us draying from his appointed task. Oh, what are we going to do with him? Snap his neck. Snap his neck. Right, we can upgrade this now. 
Dark magic is mine to command. I would really like to see the quality of the rest of these troops. This is a great skelly versus skelly battle. They've got two lords. I think I'd lose. Um, I'm going to build up this one first, just because that's on the border. Like, he's kind of nestled in the middle. Of the, I mean, I realise they can come around and attack it, but... Chances of that happening are less than if they just attack into this. Um, I, will not. I, refuse. I mean, that's 21 plus the garrison. It's 27 units. I can't see what the other fucking units are. My I don't have any real power units. No hmm. I haven't fought any big battles to get any um, raised deeds going very well. I think it'd be silly to attack into them. Um, there's orcs there, I'm not too worried about them at this stage. I'm mainly skeletons, right? No, I think that'd be silly to attack into there. I think we'll just hold where we are. Um, I don't think there's anything I can do this turn if we're not going to be attacking. No. I might drop this necromancer out. Although I could, guess we could build him up down this path instead. I don't really like having, um... Oh, they I don't really like having two casters in an army. Just because the, um, Wings of Magic pull was not that great. Yeah, I don't, I don't think... I mean, I could put him up the other way, that's fine. I don't think we can attack this at this stage. Let's just hold fire. There's three turns. I mean, nothing's going to happen in the next couple of turns anyway. Uh, Master of do I drop out the zombies and put more skeletons in? And then attack. Uh, yeah, I think I think we were just biting off more than we can chew if we attack into that now. I've got to level up. That's nice. Um, yeah, I think that would be silly to attack into that as it stands. Migration, right? What do you want to do? Do nothing, or do you want to have public order minus three? I think we're okay on public order. Yes, we are. So that's with that, with after that buff thing we just got, so that's nice. Oh, he leveled up. Yeah, so we can go down this um, route here, which what would we take? And come from more buildings probably. And then we can use them as an assassin. I think that's the good, the good, the good, the best um, use for them. Have their army moved off? Never. Yeah, they have. Okay, well let's jump in there now. Sorry. Just backstabbed you. Oh, I've been intercepted. Ah. Oh, sorry. It's opportunity for us to be intercepted. To intercept, I should say. Your army spotted an enemy force waiting to ambush. Undeterred by the discovery, the enemy is moving to intercept. I don't understand. Are we intercepting them or are they intercepting us? Your army, your army spotted an enemy force waiting to ambush. Undeterred by their discovery, the enemy is moving to intercept. So we discovered them. So this is their main army. So what have we got? Cryptgulls, which are an issue, but we counter those with Graveguard. Decent number of skellies. A lot of zombies. A lot of bats. Okay, we can take this. We can take it. We may not be able to push on to um, the settlement after this battle, though. We'll have to see what's left. Fairly confident we can take this, but we'll see. So they were setting up an ambush. The bastards. They were going to try and ambush us, boys. How rude. Right. Uh, we won't gamble on that. We'll just start the point. Right. 
I don't really want to hold my advance for three units of zombies. So let's not. So let's... That's my two strongest units in the middle. Zombies on the... F ah, sorry. Skeletons on the flanks. Corpse cart near my two strongest units. Uh, along with my lords. What am I going to do with the zombies? The zombies are going to take forever to get there. Right, bats. Bats, 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 bats. Right, they're there. Right. Uh, spears, I really would like to see where they have their dogs to counter with spears, but it's okay. There we go. We're happy. I'm happy with that setup. That's that's pretty nice. Yeah? Good, good melee line? Yes, let's just have a look at it. Do some K action on that. Beautiful straight formation of skeletons. <laughs> it seems counterintuitive, doesn't it, that you'd actually have straight formations of skeletons. Then to the awesome looking grave guard. Oh, so cool. So cool. Screaming down here, and this is our skeleton renowned unit. I do love the upgrades, eh? I'm really hoping that we see some um, orc action in the next DLC. I'm going to love to see some upgraded black orcs. Even some boys. Oh, so cool. And corpse cart has a steady supply of corpses. Oh, that guy has no mouth. No, he doesn't. This guy here. He's got no bottom jaw. No bottom mandible. Mandible? Mandible something. Right, and there's our lords just hanging out. At the same staff. Yeah. Right, bats. Let's go. Right, let's do this. Right, so what have they got? They've got bats in the center on the sides. We've got zombies. Skeleton warriors on the flank. Zombies. Crypt ghouls. Yeah, I'm happy with that. I think our setup can handle that. Do we wait for them? we we'll wait for them. That actually gives us a chance to move our zombies forward. And they can actually soak that initial charge. That's a good idea. Hey, they're going real fast, these zombies. Why are you moving it so fast? Oh, is that the renowned ones? No, it's not. The renowned ones are over there. Why are these guys running so fast compared to these? Don't know. That massive speed of 20. I was just. Yeah, they do. The renowns have faster. They walk faster. Good work, zombies. Right, I'm not going to. Um, Wait for them to charge into me. I'm just going to wait for them to get a wee bit closer. This is going to actually allow my zombies to get into the battle, which is good. I soak a lot of that damage. Actually, they're not coming any further forward than that. They're trying to flank with these. Alright, let's move you guys around. Are they doing the same on this side? No. I don't care if they charge into the side of this. This is fine. <laughs> Watch out there, what are you doing, zombies? Our skeletons, just pushing your way through. Might reform those lines. Totally facing the wrong way, boys. Oh, no, you're not. You're fine. Okay, that's cool. Right, here they come. Let's get ready to push forward. Let's go. Let's go. Get their charge off. Right, where's my bats here? I'm going to throw my bats into. Um, actually, I'm going to raise uh, Crypt Ghouls. Ah, uh, not Crypt Ghouls. Um, skeleton Goods. I can't remember what they're called. Right, I'm going to leave my Lords out of it this time. There's a lot of hit point replenishment we can use. I don't need to use it just yet. So I've got Skeletons there. Where's my Bats? Not involved yet. Right, let's chase down their Bats with my Bats. Good, right, these guys need to come up and join in on this. Don't get outnumbered there. Yeah, we've got two units of bats against their one on this side, so that's fine. Oh, that unit's in a bit of trouble. We knock off one of these. Actually, it's going to go down real fast. Did we raise that or not? No, we didn't. Right. Now we can, right behind them. Nice. Nice. 
Uh, do we have a heal available? Yes, we do. Let's chuck that on this unit of renown. Keep them up and running. Right, how are we going over this side? We've probably won on this flank. I think we've lost on this side, though. Yeah, it's going to collapse. Can I pull these off? My lord is under attack. Which one? Oh, yeah, they got bats on them. That's okay. I've got two lords here to take out one unit of bats. That's fine. Right, so I've got them surrounded with the Summoned and Crypt... Summoned and <laughs> Grave Guard. Jesus Christ. I keep calling them Crypt Ghouls. Yeah, bats don't do a lot of damage, do they? No. Is that another unit, or is that the same unit? That might be another unit. Right, let's chuck a heal out onto... No, everything's fine, actually. It's not. Awesome. Don't chase, please. Oh, these guys are collapsing. I do need to offer some support on this side. Can I... No, he's surrounding that. How are we going? Are these guys one yet? No. Right, get some bats in on top of these. Awesome. Right. Yeah, we're definitely going to push down this side, but we're going to lose a lot in the process. Can I bring my lords down, or at least one of them down this way to offer a bit of morale? Chuck a heal down on the scent. Why don't walk straight through the middle? Oh, those guys aren't even fighting. Right, I'll pull my bats out. Back down this way for a bit of help down here now. I'm pretty confident we've got this one up this side. Can I pull, the, can I pull these guys out? And bring them back around the back side. Because that's just zombies. Yep, get us around on. That's good. Alright, that's going to deal with that. All the units in the centre are collapsing. But they've got more units over this side than I do. Right, if we can push through onto this. And get in there and have a look at the section. That's all collapsing in the centre. Oh, my lord's in the middle of there too. It's kind of like three battles going on, eh? I think we've actually won up here. No, still not. Jesus. Right, let's get that buff going. That'll help us even faster to kill this off. Uh, can I check here on something? Not enough to double? No. Damn. I think it's their lord that's doing the damage on this side. Probably want to get my lords over there as well. Push forward, boys. Unlock that so we don't try and stay in formation. Let's just push in. Oh, just, oh, can you guys hurry up and win, please? Kind of need that extra support. <laughs> How far away are we from a um, heal? We need six, but I want to overcast it. Quite a while then, I'd say. Does this give me any more replenishment? No. Maybe we've actually got their lord down to about half. Actually, it's below half. Right, so they put some dogs in. That's not going to work out in their favour. I'll break these grave guard off and attack into that. <laughs> so we've got a heal, but we need what to overcharge. I'm not sure. I think it's probably nine. Oops. Alright, these guys have all won now. Nice. Right, their lord's down. That's into that. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, that was big numbers. That was big numbers. Like I said, uh, if we were going to fight that, I didn't think we could push on to the settlement, and it looks like that's exactly the case. Hmm. Although we may get quite a lot of um, raised dead out of this because it was a bigger battle. Uh, because it was a bigger battle. So, hopefully, 
It's a lot of numbers there. Uh, we'll take the replenishment because we need it. We do have a battle marker, so that's good. Oh, we've unlocked uh, the direwolves. Nice, nice. Necromancer. So we'll definitely take those. Okay. Get them back. Really? Have they changed it so that the quality of the troops you can raise is directly related to the quality of the troops that dies? Kind of looks that way, doesn't it? Ah, oh, can I push onto this? Can I assist you? I probably can. Right, he's leveled as well, so that's good. Uh, so we've got that one there, which is. She breaks if we fight with him. Okay. I'll take the curse of the undeath. That sounds good. Um, I could actually raise a lot more zombies. If we go like this. Can I merge you with you? Yes. Oh, I could actually get the two skeleton spears. did lose a unit of bats, but we did gain a unit of dogs out of that, so that's okay. We should actually be alright to push on now. Got the replenishment going, our lords are fine. Let's go. Yeah, nice. Nice, nice, nice. So that's going to give us um, all of Sylvania. So that's good. In two episodes we've got all the Sylvania. Nice. Now, nah, occupy, okay, of course. Awesome. So now we can do a public order one because we'll need it. Because we're at minus five at the moment. Just be careful about these empire forces. Um, now we want to just kind of consolidate a wee bit. Build up a wee bit of power back here. Um, I can upgrade that one this time. Cool. Awesome. Alright guys, we're going to wrap up the episode there. We are over 40 minutes. So hopefully you've enjoyed episode two. Remember if you did to like, comment and subscribe. Actually we'll do this here before we leave. I just grabbed another one. Um, I, oh, every bloody episode I do that, eh? Uh, we'll do the buff. He leveled two. So that's good. See there. Are... It was either these two, right? Actually, can I get a horse? Right, so it was either this or this. I mean, because we're going to be attacking more with this guy than sitting at home, even though we're sitting at home at the moment, I think this one's a better option for us at this stage. All right, guys, that'll wrap us up for this episode. If you did like it, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.